Hey everyone, Paul from The Fan Voice here, and today I wanted to take a quick look at the new King K. Rule Me outfit, because interestingly enough, it seems to reminisce a lot more to the SNES version of King K. Rule rather than his more modern version. Look at the crown for example. See how it's like super long and pointy? It's like almost taking up half the crown. That's definitely from the original version where it was more established like that and then in the newer version they've been trying to like make it more balanced I think and less like super long thin points. And then we have the eyeball. Super iconic for King K. Rule. But in the newer versions they've definitely been toning it down. Like, I guess not to frighten children, uh, understandably. But in the older version, you can see it's super crazy bloodshot and gross and stuff. And in the this uh, me costume version, you can definitely see some bloodshot, uh, more than the newer one, but not quite as much as the older. But it's still like crazy, like popping out of his head, like in the older version. And then like the biggest one, which I love, is they made the belly shiny. Is his nice shiny golden belly which is totally weird but I loved and uh, that's my favorite callback in this new me outfit and as you can see his new belly is just tan uh, nothing special I don't know this shiny belly it represents more of his royalty I suppose I enjoy it and probably the most important distinction is the skin look how they did the skin it's very like off pale green and scaly, rough, like uh, the older version. But in this newer version, it's very smooth and very rich, vibrant green, which is kind of my biggest problem with current Nintendo designs is they've done a lot to just make everything look super clean, rounded, and polished, and I think that's kind of a double-edged sword, especially for villains or bad guys. Nothing can really look as intimidating, like, even if they try to look scary, they still have a hint of cutesiness in them because everything's way too polished in the era of the Wii U version. So if King K. Rool really does become a Smash fighter, I really hope they follow through with the aesthetics of this me costume because I really do miss those old rare designs. They were the slightest bit strange and off and creepy at times, but that just added to the curiousness of them. And made the designs really unique in the world of Nintendo. So uh, that's all I got today, so I hope you enjoyed this little analysis of this me costume, and here's to looking forward to the future of maybe seeing King K. Rule. You know? Hopefully. I hope so. Okay, until next time guys, I'll see you later.